Hello there, this is Todd from the Scoundrels Cantina, and welcome to another episode of a Star Wars story. In this video, we'll be telling you the story of Arf Sergeant Hound of the Coruscant Guard, who's most notably seen in the amazing Star Wars The Clone Wars TV series. As always, we're mixing the expanded universe and canon, because we believe that there's no reason why most of it can't fit together. So anyway, let's begin. The clone nicknamed Hound was born around 32 years before the Battle of Yavin on the planet Kamino as part of the Grand Army of the Republic to fight against the enemies of the Republic such as the Confederacy of Independent Systems. He was a genetic replica of the legendary Mandalorian bounty hunter Jango Fett, as was the entire clone army. As the Clone Wars began in 22 BBY, Hound was immediately stationed in the Republic's capital of Coruscant and became part of the Clone Law Enforcement Unit known as the Coruscant Guard. There he served as an advanced recon force trooper and during the first year of the war he wore phase 1 ARF trooper armor. Eventually ARF trooper Hound would be promoted to the rank of sergeant. Around 21 BBY, the entire Grand Army of the Republic, including the Coruscant Guard, received Phase 2 clone armor, which meant that Sergeant Hound and his fellow ARF troopers received the standard Phase 2 ARF trooper armor. Since he was stationed on Coruscant, where reconnaissance wasn't needed of the ARF troopers, they didn't have any need for the ARF scout trooper or the ATRT driver armor variants of the advanced recon force troopers. Since Sergeant Hound served in a law enforcement unit as an ARF trooper, the advanced recon force troopers needed a new purpose on Coruscant, so they started working with reptilian creatures called Massives, which served them as bloodhounds while chasing fugitives. Hound's own Massive was called Greaser, and he considered him his pet and got attached to the beast. In 19 BBY, Jedi Padawan Ahsoka Tano would be framed for the death of a Republic prisoner, after which she would be hunted down by the shock troopers of the Coruscant Guard, led by Commander Fox, who believed that she herself force choked the prisoner as the prison recording showed. When she managed to escape the main Republic military base on Coruscant, Sergeant Hound and his men were deployed to sniff her out with their massive bloodhounds. As he searched outside the Republic base, Greaser caught her scent, although lost it when she climbed up the clone monuments in front of the military base. As Commander Fox exited the base, he immediately saw Ahsoka and ordered all of his men to chase her and not let her escape to her ship. Hound was the first to react and started chasing her with his men, although as a Jedi, Ahsoka was much faster. While Ahsoka was running for her life, Anakin Skywalker, her master, and Clone Captain Rex order all the troops to set their weapons for stun in order to not hurt her. After a long chase with LAT Republic gunships and many troopers of the Coruscant Guard, Hound and his men managed to surround her from all sides, but once again, she managed to elude them by cutting a hole with her lightsaber in one of the pipes nearby and escaping. Not long after, Order 66 was issued by Chancellor Palpatine, which activated the entire clone army's inhibitor chips, thus forcing them to eliminate their Jedi friends. Sergeant Hound most likely hunted the Jedi fugitives across Coruscant and would serve the newly formed Galactic Empire. Sadly, this is as far as Arf Sergeant Hound's story goes, but nonetheless, he's a great addition to the Star Wars galaxy. Anyway guys, this is it on the story of Sergeant Hound, and we hope you all enjoyed it, and learned something new about the vast galaxy of Star Wars. If you enjoy our content, make sure to check out our second lore channel, The Crossroads Inn, and if you want to watch more videos like this one, the links to the playlist of other Star Wars stories and videos will be down below. Also, if you want to support this channel, hit that subscribe button for more videos like this one. And remember guys, God is awesome, may the force be with you always, and we'll see you in another video. You rebel scum. This party's over.